Hello everyone, my name is Jamin. Thanks so much for visiting my channel. In this video, I'm working on a Dell Optiplex all-in-one system, the 5250 model. I'm gonna show you how to get inside, access your Wi-Fi card. Now, before we get going, power down your computer the correct way. Make sure it's all the way powered off. Make sure the power cord is unplugged. We're gonna flip it over, lay it flat on the screen. Make sure there's nothing underneath that can damage or scratch it. And then we're gonna go at it from the rear, try to get that panel off. Okay, so to get the stand off, there's a button right here underneath it. I'm gonna push that button down and then lift up from here to get that stand off. And the stand comes right up like that. So after removing that stand, there's no screws you have to take out. We're just gonna pry this panel up from this end here. So I'm gonna take a small flat screwdriver and very carefully just put it under there, pop this up very gently. You can see I'm just going around the bottom, try not to put it way far in, just on the edge. And you can pop that right up. So after taking that panel off, this is what it's looking like for the inside of the computer. Now, as a general computer repair side note, whenever I'm working on a computer in my shop, I have it sitting on this anti-static mat. Either that or an anti-static bracelet are great ideas to avoid damaging anything in your computer when you're working on it. If you would like any help with tools or supplies for your computer project, as well as all of the replacement and upgrade parts for this specific model, the 5250, there'll be a link above. Also below in the description, it'll be a list of all the things I use in my shop, and again, all the replacement and upgrade parts for this model computer. Right here, you have this metal panel to access some more components. Again, no screws. This is a very nice computer to work on. There's just a pull tab here. So you push that down a little bit and then slide it that way. And that panel comes right off pretty easily. This is your Wi-Fi card here. The Wi-Fi card is held down by a single screw here. And then once you undo that screw, you can pull it out of this port. And then after that, all you have are these antenna wire that snap onto it. Those are just snaps. They pull directly up and off of the Wi-Fi card but you do need to have them at a perfect 90 degree angle to snap them back down. And you are strong enough to damage them if they're not at the right angle and you try to force it. So just be slow and patient. It can be a little bit of a pain in the butt if you're not used to it, but you will be able to get those back down. I will have all the Wi-Fi card specs below in the description if you need help finding your own replacement, but I will also have a Wi-Fi card replacement option below in the description in that link I told you about with all of the replacement parts for this model computer. If you guys have any questions, check out the FAQs in the description below. It could save you some time getting an answer, but if you do need to leave me a question or comment, I do try to get to those at least a couple times a day. Thank you so much for watching guys. I look forward to seeing you on my next video.